Allie, can you tell us about the Women in Communications you started? Yeah, so I felt like we didn't have a group like this on campus. We have a lot of groups that are specifically journalism, specifically PR. We have women in technology. So I felt like this was something we didn't have on campus, so why not bring it to our campus? And what was the process of, I know it's a long process to get an organization here on campus. What was that like for you? Yeah, so at the beginning of the semester, we had a lot of deadlines we had to meet. Uh, we have to have a certain amount of e-board members, a certain amount of general body members, had to get an advisor to help us through the whole process. Then we had to fill out an application create a whole constitution, which is a lot harder than you might think, yeah. um, and then hand that all in, have an interview, and kind of go through the whole process. That's amazing. Um, so who can be a part of this club? Anybody. Anybody who can be a part of this club who has any interest in communications. Um, we're going to be focus focusing specifically on women empowerment, but anyone can be a part of it. If you're in comm design, if you're in CRS, if you're in Newhouse, whatever you might have an interest in, you can come on out. And what kind of events will women in communications be doing? Is there going to be weekly meetings, um, you know, speakers, stuff like that? Right now we're still kind of building what we want this club to be exactly. We're thinking of networking events to kind of build, build the network that people have so when they're going into the professional field, this is something that can help them. Have resume workshops, speakers, a book club. We got a lot of options that we have and we're going to try and do as much as we can. And how can students get involved in this? Well, we have our first general interest meeting on Monday. It's 8.30, uh, New House 1, room 102. So they can come out to that and see what our group is all about. And then kind of keep coming to meetings. We have an email listserv that people can get on and we'll email out whenever we have meetings and whenever we have different uh, different functions going on and just come out to that and join us. And how has your experience sort of in college and in the professional world through internships did that motivate you to get this group um, here on campus? Right, uh, so I actually uh, received a scholarship about two years ago from New York Women in Communications, which we're not affiliated with them in any way, but that inspired me to start, this is a professional group for Women in Communications, why not have a group for college kids here on campus that can kind of filter into things like that, so that was definitely a big inspiration for me. I also have friends at Ithaca College who started a similar group, so they've been a big help in, in kind of making the groups kind of bounce off each other. And what do you plan to change here on campus by having this organization here? I think we can change uh, how women kind of see themselves now in, in education and communications and then moving themselves into the professional world. We just want to empower women to see that this is something that you can totally be a part of and you can totally bring into the professional world and still be empowered and still love what you're doing. And it may be an intimidating thing to go into communications in the professional world, yeah. but <laughs> we're all in it together and we're all going to do it great. Yeah, as a senior and so, and you, we all are as yep. well going <laughs> out into the working world in just a few months to have I would think to have this organization like Women in Communications and a group of people that you can go to for just, hey, this happened at work, what can I do about it? Even right. after they graduate, I'm sure is an important mm -hmm. part of what you uh, want to do as well. And even as a freshman, I can remember being a little fish in a big world. Oh, yeah. And I just, an organization like this would probably really make me want to get more involved on campus and really just make me realize I'm here and I love what I'm doing and other women are too and kind of feel... And I'm so excited for this. I think great. It's be uh, that's great what for we're campus. really hoping that's what it'll be, and yep. we hope everyone's really excited. About well, thanks yeah. for joining us, Hallie. We can't wait to see uh, what great things Women in Communications does. Thanks. Yeah.